tried to rape me. Angie, hi. I've been looking for you. Oh, uh, well, I decided to come outside and get some sun and wait for my parents. I'm so glad I found you before you got away. So I could tell you what I think of you. You are the most vicious, conniving person I've ever known in my life. Angie. You don't care about other people at all. You don't even care if you ruin their whole lives. And you have flipped out. What are you talking about? Oh, you know what I'm talking about. I am talking about your accusing Jesse of attempted rape. Liza, how could you do that? He attacked me, Angie. I had to tell people. You, know, you liar. Don't insult my intelligence. Now, you are lying about the whole thing. Listen, now, you I were there, and you would never do anything like that. Angie. I didn't have to be there. Now, Jesse might have slapped you because you deserved it. But don't flatter yourself, my dear. He would never try to rape you. The only reason you're defending him is because he used to be your boyfriend. And you're trying to set him up just because you hate him. Hate him? Just because he's an obnoxious little... Little what? Life. I don't think I need to talk to you anymore. You already have your biased little mind made I up. I am warning you, Miss Liza, you are not going to get away with this. The time is going to come when everyone will know that Jesse is innocent. Oh, if he is, then why did he run away? Hmm? Hmm, Angie? I don't know. But I know that he was very special to me. He was the most special guy that I have ever known in my life, and thanks to you, I may never see him again. If that's so, then you ought to thank me, Angie. You're right, Jessie. She's a witch. Mm -hmm.